Hey guys, it's Miss Kaysen here with another problem for you. Uh, this is the problem from your homework. Um, we are going to use the equal values method to solve this system. We have y equals 1 fourth x plus 5 and y equals 2x minus 9. So you'll notice that both equations are um, set to y equals. So both equations equal y. So that means that we can set the two equal to each other. So we're going to write 1 fourth x plus 5 equals 2x minus 9. And that is how we can set up our equation to solve for x. Notice there is a fraction in there. So I'm going to multiply the entire equation by 4 because we want to get rid of that denominator of 4. So we're going to rewrite this equation by writing um, an equivalent equation. So when I multiply every term by 4, I get 4 over 4x plus 20, because 4 times 5 is 20, equals, um, we get 8x, because 4 times 2x is 8x, and then 4 times 9 is 36. So there is our new equivalent equation. Next I'm going to simplify 4 over 4x. That's just 1x, so I've rewritten the equation. Now I can solve. That fraction was eliminated, so I subtract x from both sides. I get 20 equals 7x minus 36. Now I can add 36 to both sides. Then on the left, I get 56 equals 7x. Divide both sides by 7, and I get my x term of x equals 8. Am I done? Now uh, you know we're not done yet. We have to solve for y. So I'm going to take my solution for x. I plugged it into the first equation. You can see here I have y equals 1 fourth times 8 plus 5. So multiplying that across, I get y equals 8 over 4 which gives me 2. Simplifying, I get y equals 7. Last step, let's put that solution into an ordered pair. I get 8, 7, and there is our solution.